If you decide that you want to start carrying a firearm on you daily for personal protection, you then have to start thinking about how you're going to carry it. This is where holsters is becoming a huge market right now, and there's a ton of options that we're seeing more come out all the time. Some of the most common options that you'll see will be both leather, kydex, or a hybrid between the two. So a leather holster as this is something that can be very comfortable. It can be worn on the waistband or in the waistband. You'll find that two of the most common areas that people carry would either be on their back hip or is what's called an appendix carry. A lot of times, if somebody's carrying in their back hip, you may want something like this where you can easily tuck it in your pants. There's not a lot of bulk that comes with it, and it's gonna be comfortable against your skin throughout the day. There's some other really great options that are coming out that are going to have that Kydex. People really like Kydex because it's a really good way to have trigger guard protection. You make sure that nothing gets in there and messes with that. And it's also going to be comfortable when you have a material like leather or mesh in the back. This is again, something that can be worn right through your belt loops on the outside of your clothes, or you can tuck this in your waistband. Now men typically are going to be wearing more of a tra trouser style pant where they're going to be able to wear a belt. For women, there's a really great uh, genre that's kind of coming into the market that's called more of carry wear. So these pants are more of an athletic pant. They also come in like a solid black where you could even wear them to more of like a business or work setting. I really like these because you can see that there's already built in areas for carry and trigger guard protection right on the garment itself. That adds less bulkiness to your clothing and it makes it a little bit more comfortable throughout the day as the garment moves with you and so does your firearm. So no matter how you decide to carry, you wanna try to be consistent with it and carry in the same place every day and especially Especially you want to train. This is a really great place to employ those dry fire practices where you practice safely holstering and unholstering from however you choose to carry and making sure that your finger is in the correct position and that you're ready should you ever have the need to draw quickly.